Practical Conversations. Welcome, students. The car handles very well and is a good deal. It seems to be a good choice for you. You might want to have a mechanic take a look at it just to be sure. My friend is a mechanic, and he came and looked at it for me this morning. That was smart of you to think ahead. Have you and the seller agreed upon a price? Yes, he is willing to accept that price I offered him. Have you thought about how you're going to pay for your car? I saved up enough money to pay cash for this car. You really thought this through. Why don't I go with you to make the payment and drive your car home for you? That would make it a lot easier for me. Let's go take care of that right now. I really want to see your new car. Hello, Nicole here. Nicole, this is Richard. I think you know why I'm calling. Uh oh, it's about the rent. Yes, this is the second month in a row. I thought there was a grace period. There is no grace period in the rental agreement. Oh, I guess I forgot. Well, when can I expect the rent? You'll get it by Monday. Don't forget the fifty-dollar late fee. Is that in the rental agreement? The late fee is circled in red ink. Oh, well, I can't find my copy of the agreement. If you're late next month, I might have to give you an eviction notice. Hello, could you tell me my test results? Your results are posted on the website. Just put in your password, and you can see the exact numbers. Are you saying that all my results were normal? We always contact you by phone to come in if there is a need for follow-up. How will I know what the results mean on the website? The purpose of each test is given on the site. Will the numbers mean anything to me? The website will give you your results and then tell you what the normal range is. Can I see all of my test results at once? Yes, you can see every test for the past five years. You can compare them. Thank you. See you next time.